Okay. Okay. This is question two B I of the inheritance uh, topic test. So the question is: Explain one piece of evidence from the diagram which proves that the allele for Tay-Sachs disease is recessive. There is a similar question at the very start of the paper where there's two black cats that have white kittens which, and it asks for evidence that they are, that the white is recessive. So the similar case here, we can see that males, the male three and female four who are unaffected have uh, offspring male nine who is affected and female eleven who is also affected. So, you, so, using the evidence, you can say unaffected, unaffected male three and unaffected female four. Four produce produce affected. Male nine and female female eleven. Therefore, therefore, males male three and female four for are. Heterozygous heterozygous with Tay Sachs allele. So that would get you two marks by identifying the unaffected females and affected males, and then mentioning that they're heterozygous with the Tay Sachs allele. With, and you could also add recessive, just to show that because they're unaffected, but they have the allele that it is recessive. To relate it back to the question, so that would get two marks. And remember to mention the numbers as well, which is important because they want evidence from the diagram. So, okay, so the next part of the question: one piece of evidence which proves that allele for Tay Sachs is not on the X chromosome. Well. If it were on, well, obviously this is a sex-leaked question because the X chromosome is one of the sex chromosomes, X or Y. So if it asks whether it's on the X chromosome or not, then it's asking whether it's sex-linked. So if the allele, if allele was on, if allele was on the X chromosome. So we want we want evidence to the contrary of whether Ali was on the X chromosome. So I think a good idea would be to write out uh, write out the genotypes uh, of the sex chromosomes, presuming that it is sex linked, and then we will find something that doesn't add up. So that would be X Y with a little T. That would be small T. Big T. That one again would be big T, little T. Uh, this one we don't know. We, oh, actually, we have, we, of course we, we do know that would be big, big T, Y. So Y and big T from the male and the female. That one, that one would. Well, you'd think that that would be little T, Y. And this one would be X, T, Y. And that all adds up, so that's all possible. Then we get to female 11, which would have X, T, which is little, and big T. But, wait, sorry, that should be big T. Yeah, that's big T there. X, big T, Y. But if we look, at female 11 gets to, sorry, recessive gets two small t's but only one of the small t's is available from the gametes so if if allele was on the x chromosome 
female 11 would have would have genotype XT XT and uh, male 3 would have would have genotype XTY so would be affected Therefore, Tay-Sachs allele is not on the X chromosome. Mm-hmm.